Well, if you're just joining us now, we're live near Broadway and Main Street on a beautiful evening where the 2022 Waukesha Christmas Parade will run this November. And I'm joined by Sandy Feller, director of the Waukesha Extreme Dance Team here. And you got some of your team members here behind you. Just give me a general sense. The parade is still four to five months away, but it's going to be broadcast live now on TMJ4. How important is that for the community and the people in this area? to see that parade this year? I think it's very important. I think they should be either, if they can't be here, to watch it on TV. Yeah. I just think it would be awesome for them. Take me through this transition that you've gone through since the Christmas parade to now still dancing. And what's that transition been like for your team? Um, it's been hard. Um, initially, it was very, very hard. Of course, we had at the beginning, not a lot of dancers and, um, we went, we did a couple of performances and competitions, and we also performed in Disney World in February. I think that was a good healing thing for the girls to just get away and be somewhere different and performing. Yeah. So how, how have you worked through this with, with the girls, and what kind of support have you received as a result of people seeing the story? Um, well, we had a GoFundMe account set up, which was distributed to all the dancers and the injured. And um, I just think overall, the community, we had so many cards um, from all over the world. And I understand there's an interesting pay it forward moment coming up for your team. Yes. We are going to dance camp this coming week, and we thought that we would have all of our dancers, including the 200 girls that will be at camp, to see if they would like to reach out and make a lot of cards for them, and then we're going to take them or send them to each of the families. Uh, so it, it, what have you noticed from the girls as they've moved forward? Uh, tragedy is so hard, the trauma of what they've gone through. But does dance give them that ability to move forward? I think so. I've always said, if you're having a rough day, dance it out. You can never feel any better than by dancing. And so, I can see yeah. that on the smiles behind you there yes, with these I love it. ladies. Thank you for joining us and the best of luck to you. We'll see you this Christmas.